Greetings fellow viewers, this is CJ Pippa Princess and today we are doing another baking introduction video where today I'm going to be using the Nestle, is that pronounced? The Nestle chocolate chip cookie recipe and let's get started. First of all, wash your hands. Second, preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit, not Celsius. The next thing to do is put two sticks of butter in room temperature and then put them in the nearest mixer. If you don't have a mixer, then use a beater. I'm going to close this and then lock it and go over here and put it on. Oh, it's not plugged in. Make sure to plug in <laughs> your thing. All right. I'll make it go a little bit faster. Now see, we just wait until it is pretty creamy. Once it is completely creamy, as you can see here, turn off your mixer or stop beating and put in three quarters of a cup of granulated sugar. I'm gonna carefully put this in. So add three quarters of a cup of brown sugar. Now make sure it is packed like you just saw here, like you're making a sandcastle. Right, let's put this down and put this in the mixer with the sugar and the creamy butter and continue it until it's creamy as well let's lock this one okay while it is creaming we have to combine two and one quarter cups of flour and sift it right here as you can see just shake it or you can use a fork it's your choice man i love doing this also, you're going to need to use a teaspoon of baking soda. You can see that it's half teaspoon, but that that's okay too. Just put two of them in there. And you also need to add a teaspoon of salt. Make sure it is baking salt, not salt that you like put on peas. So one, two. Use a fork to combine all the salt, the baking soda, and the flour all together. You're going to take a break. I have KFC. The next thing to do is to crack these two eggs and put them in the mixing bowl oh, one at a time and make sure they are beat well between every egg. Alright, put one teaspoon of vanilla extract in the bowl once it is creamy. All right, when it is creamy like it is right now, it should look like this. Add in one and add in the flour mixture. Add in about one and a half scoops at a time. When um, the first batch is fully mixed in, then add in the next batch and do that until the bowl is empty. And just a side note, if the flour isn't getting mixed into the bowl in a mixer or if you're beating it, Scrape it down to sides with a rubber spatula. If you have, you can also. Uh, I also recommend uh, taking the batter that is on the um, the mixer thing out on it too. There we go, and continue it. Let's do this, and boom. Pro tip, baking can be really messy. So if you make a mess in any way, please clean it up. When it is done mixing, here is the ingredient. Add in two cups of Nestle's chocolate chips. I put them in a bowl just to get started. We'll put, put them in. All right, we're gonna mix them in so that it just won't be a giant bunch of chocolate chips that we're going to put in the pan. When it is done, we're gonna put it in a pan where we're gonna bake them. Woohoo! Once it is done, the batter should look like this. Then we take a spoon and we put this on. Okay, so we're just gonna put this on here. You can use your fingers if you want to, but just make sure you've washed your hands first, like I said in the first step. Now, when it is done setting out pans like this, and the oven is at 375 degrees, 
we put it in the oven top and the bottom now when it is in make sure you set a timer for 9 to 11 minutes I recommend you put it at 10 now let's when it's done you put it on a cooling rack like oh, this one over here and let it cool for two minutes when it is done, repeat this step. But if you can't do all of the batter in time, just color, cover it, just cover it in cellophane and put it in the fridge. All right, since the cookies are done, we're going to do a taste test. Just your classic cookie. Make sure to give this a like if you liked it. Leave a comment below if you want any more food suggestions of which I could bake. And make sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos like gaming, role plays, and more baking. Ciao!